It was a very painful exit for the players, who started well winning all three games in the group for the first time in our history, even though the team didn't get the necessary support to prepare for the tournament. No training tour, no international friendlies, but we still got to this stage with own base players. At the quarter-final stage, we fell to Netherlands, two goals to nil, via two first half goals, and the wait for an African team to win the Women Under 20 World Cup still continues. Take a look at the statistics of the game. We had 27 shots in total and 11 on target, but we couldn't find the net. It wasn't just our day. This is the fifth time Nigeria will lose at the quarterfinals of the 20 Women's World Cup. And this time around, it was surely painful. This just reminds me of the Super Eagles at the African Cup of Nations in 2021, when we won our group with 9 points but lost in the quarterfinals. Regardless of the loss, I want to say I'm super proud of the team. From Esther Wayne Zidie to Florissa Bastin, to Deborah Biodun, to Oluwatos in the main, to Rafia Timura, even the goalkeeper, keep your head up. You guys did us proud today, even though we lost. And just like Washita Tajibade said, Whatever happens, don't think, don't think about it. We are here to support you guys because we know what it takes. The best is yet to come. Yes, we are super proud of you guys, win or lose. Congratulations to the Netherlands, who in my opinion had a solid plan and approach to the game. And they executed it well. They were technically better, they played well as a team, and they surely have the right atmosphere in the country for players to thrive and develop. And just like our coach Chris Andruma said, A day will come, we'll step up everything we do and we'll rule the world. I don't like to criticize under 17 and under 20 players because, in my opinion, they are still growing and they are still learning. And I hope some of these players are able to transition to the Super Falcons in the future and represent Nigeria at international competitions going forward. Let's just appreciate the team. Thanks for watching, and as always, have a good day.